So I'm just spinning around in this chair, thinking about making maybe a, a short Pokemon Go series, and of course there are legends now available in the game, and and what if I actually made it like a short series of Pokemon Go and just, just, yeah, <laughs> play the game. <laughs> Hopefully you guys will enjoy it though, but I'll of course go out there and record some Pokemon Go uh, content for you guys when I'm trying to catch the legends, because some legends are available in Pokemon Go at the moment, and I really want to catch them all, I really want to catch all of them, and as a lot of you guys know, Lugia is in the game, um, I've tried to get it, uh, Zapdos will be in the game, uh, Moltres will be in the game, Articuno is already in the game, and that's the one I'm hunting for right now. So. Um, I'm going to show you guys on screen right there the information we have so far. And now we can battle Art Art uh, la, 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 la. Articuno, Moltres, Zapdos in raid battles around the world. And Articuno is from now. Well, it's going to end on Monday though. So hopefully I will get Articuno uh, before that ends. Moltres will be right after. It will be 31st of July and it will end on the uh, 7th of August. And then Zapdos for the Instinct members will be available, or it's a, of course available for everyone, um, but Zapdos will be available from the 7th of August to the 14th. So I'm gonna share my hunt for these legends, and of course Lugia. I have no idea when Lugia is gonna, the Lugia event is gonna end, I have no idea. I have to go out there and just try and find it. So I've already been on a hunt, and as you can see here, I found uh, Larvitar when I was going out, and I was pretty happy with that, because I need uh, Tyranitar, but, Something happened, something happened. Before uh, we found Lugia or Articuno in the raid battle, we found a, a uh, Tyranitar battle. And I'm gonna show you guys the whole battle on in this video, and hopefully you guys will enjoy it. So uh, so let's uh, let's check out the raid. And here you see the raids going down, the clock is ticking. Uh, I'm trying to, to, to pick my team. This is the first raid battle I have done in Pokemon Go. I haven't been playing Pokemon Go, Go in a while, so now I was just thinking, I really want to record it because I installed uh, um, iOS 11 on my phone. It's in beta at the moment, beta, and it can actually record the iPhone screen, which is brilliant. It's amazing. So I tested it out. It worked perfectly. So if you guys want to record your screen as well, you should definitely test out the uh, iOS 11 for iPhone. There, here we go. We are counting down. This is my team. I have two Dragonites. I actually found a wild Dragonite. I didn't record it because it was the day before I downloaded iOS 11 so I could record the screen, but here we go, I've managed to do it, and here's one of the Dragonites, it's the one with the highest CP here, and as you can see we have 15 seconds left before the battle is starting, and I choose my Gyarados, I choose my Vaporeon, um, and, and two other, other Pokemon, yes. So, here we go, the battle starts between uh, or versus Tyranitar. I really need Tyranitar. I have, I have like almost all the candies to evolve it, but I just want to catch it. I just want to cut, catch this beast. So we did this before we went out and looked for legendary raids. So as you can see, I'm dodging, I'm dodging this, this Tyranitar, and this guy is actually pretty powerful. He's pretty powerful, but so is my, my, my Dragonite. Oh, he hit me so bad right there. He hit me so bad. And let's use some special attacks on this guy. Let's use some special attacks on this guy. So I hit him twice, and he is raging at me as well, and ah, uh, rest in peace, Dragonite, rest in peace. There we go, my second Dragonite is on the screen, we're trying to battle this guy, it looks like it's going down, so I think I managed to to actually uh, to dodge some of his attacks here. Um, as you can see, I have a lot of my Alduin, where's Alduin from guys, where's Alduin from? It's definitely Skyrim. And here we go, he hit me so hard that I almost fainted, uh, but you can see, we are doing some massive damage towards this, this Tyranitar, and as you can see, we won, we won. Now over to the most exciting parts with raids. So there we go, we got six golden raspberries, we got four revives, uh, I got a TM, that's pretty good, that's pretty good, I got four rare candies, and I got 8,000 XP. Uh, I think I used a... Uh, I think I used the XP boost on this one, I'm not sure, I got eight Pokeballs as well, or let's call it, uh, what, what were the Pokeballs called again? Uh, they're called... Um, Premier Ball! Uh, Premier Ball, that's correct, that's correct, Premier Balls. So here we go, the first, first throw here, and let's see if we can get it. Is it one? Oh, he just pops out. 
like instantly. I don't know the catch rate on a Tyranitar, I have no idea what the catch rate is, so I'm, I'm definitely using a, a golden raspberry here. And we're spinning the ball, trying to get an increased catch rate on this guy. And you can see one, and he pops out again. This is so hard to catch. This is the, this is the Tyranitar. He's, he's amazing. He's amazing in Pokemon Go. And I still don't have it. I still don't have it. There we go. Wait, another throw. It's a great throw. And I think this is it. Let's see. One. That's one. That's two. And that's three. There we go. We caught a Tyranitar after the raid, which is amazing. Because I really, really needed this. There we go. It's re registered to Pokedex. Amazing Nava. Hold the whole evolution for this guy. But... The reason why I made this video is because um, I also also check his IVs. It, the IVs was was decent, but the reason why I made this video was because we're gonna find Lugia, and here we go, Lugia. We found it after I think an hour. It pops up a um, uh, couple of miles from where we found Tyranitar, and it's counting down. Um, I think I chose the wrong team here. I think I chose the wrong team, but. I can see uh, I have Gyarados, I have Chansey, I have... Oh, wait a second. Um, never mind. <laughs> but here we go, we're gonna battle Lugia here. Uh, and this is a tough battle. This is the Legends with the most health of the raid bosses. My Gyarados does a lot of damage, so I'm, I'm definitely gonna get myself a new Gyarados. And uh, here we go, I'm gonna use my special attack. Oh, I managed to do it. There we go, my Gyarados is going down. He, he fainted, but there we go, we're going for the next one. Chansey, your turn, and hopefully we'll do some some damage against this, this Lugia as well. Um, so, you see how, he is so huge! The, the Lugia is so freaking huge! I wish it was that huge when you catch him! That would be amazing! But, of course, it's a raid boss, and he will he will shrink when you have, have, have beaten him, and he will gain... Uh, I think his, his CP will be, will be between 2000 or something. But anyway, there we go, we have done some um, massive damage against this Lugia and we're almost halfway there, he's almost taking out my Chansey and there we go, the blast that blasted my Chansey through the sky. There we go, my Snorlax is on the field, fat, um, fat <laughs> sorry I can't say that here, uh, but there we go, he did some managed damage to my Snorlax as well, and I think he can tank this pretty much uh, a, a, lo a lot of his attacks. So here we go, we're gonna do some more damage here. He's almost down, this Lugia, he's almost down. And and there we go, we got a, a really good hit there. He, he went down, I got my Dragonite on the field, and I think my Dragonite will do the most damage against, uh, against Lugia. And there we go, we gotta use my special- Oh, he hit me so hard! <laughs> that hit me so hard! It's insane! So here we go, we are almost taking out Lugia. I think I went down to my last Pokemon on this, so I had to dodge at the end. But there we go, he did some massive damage here as well against my Dragonite. And he's using Hydro Pump. Of course, I fainted, because his Hydro Pump attack is unbelievably uh, strong. So here we go, we have my my Vaporeon. My Vaporeon had to dodge a lot because <laughs> he was almost going down and I really really didn't want to, to lose my last part before uh, before we you do you you want you you could do so you you do you could you before we was be able to beat Lugia I can't even speak today this is insane here we go he's so tiny on health and you're so close to beating him so I, I'm, I'm just joking you can do so I'm just dodging at this moment. I'm just dodging, and and there we go. We have a beaten Lugia right there. There we go. A small lag on the screen, but of course, well, mobile internet isn't perfect. But there we go. Now it's our turn to try and catch it. There we go. I got three. I only got three golden raspberries. I was just saying. I got a TM though. I got a TM. I'm really happy with that. And I got thirteen thousand XP from that battle. And GG uh, Mystic from doing the most amount of damage. I got only seven, seven Premier Balls. So this will be a tough, tough catch. So all I can do is to use the Golden Raspberry against this beast. And you can see his red circle. I saw the uh, the clips from the event at Pokemon Fest. They have this green circle because they had like 100 or 200 percent catch rate. So I'm looking forward to see their faces when they uh, when they come home and see how hard it is to catch the legends. There we go, we're using another berry here. I'm 
I think I'm down to, let's see, I can't remember which uh, amount of Pokeballs I have left. I'm not really sure, I'm not really sure. There we go, one, two, that was almost a catch guys, that was so close. Oh, that, oh, that actually... But, we are back here to, to look what will happen with this Lugia, he's attacking like Almost every single, oh there we go, every single second. A great throw, and there is one. There is two, and he escapes. I was, I was like shaking when I was doing this, I was shaking. So here we go, I have four Premier Balls left, and now I gotta do it, I have to do it. He's attacking, he's, he's like doing backflips. There we go, he, he hit my ball, he hit my ball away. God dang it, but there we go. We are back here, and to see what will happen at the end, um, I'm not gonna spoil you guys, I'm not gonna spoil you. But did I catch it? Did I escape? Who knows, who knows? I'm not gonna do my face expression here to, to actually reveal what happened. But here we go, we have down to two more two more uh, Premier Balls. So using the last, I think that was the last Golden Raspberry. And he is like, oh, I hate the, the red circle. I think the chances of catching him for me was, I think it was 12%, I think. Or maybe 15 which is pretty low. And there we go, almost tied it again. We have two of the shakes on the Premier Ball, but I have only one ball left. What will happen? What will happen? Still growing red, hit him in the head. No great, no nice throw, but this happened. He broke free and he escaped. I didn't catch Lugia, guys. So I have to go out there and try again. I have to go out there and try again, so I will definitely make more videos. Of this hopefully you guys will enjoy this short Pokemon Go series that I'm gonna make and I will of course uh, record every single moment and I, I hopefully I will be able to catch all of the legends include Lugia because now I failed I think I failed twice I record both of them but this is the most exciting one and I failed twice but anyway guys thank you so much for watching this Pokemon Go episode for today and I'll see you guys in the next one so peace out everybody